Hey guys, my name is Jason Linear. We're here at the Sutro Baths in San Francisco, California for an absolutely amazing shoot. It's amazing because I'm surrounded by beauty. Certainly not me. And, uh, but uh, we're gonna do a shoot today, guys. It's another gear I use video. Um, I've already done one on the last Light Large and so I thought it was kind of redundant, but a lot of the people here who are helping me have convinced me that showing how this diffuser works is, is beneficial as well. So we've already done a video on how to set this up. I don't want my videos to be redundant. We're gonna show you guys the value of a diffuser. And having a big diffuser like this gives you guys the ability to cut down the light on the entire body of a person rather than just uh, maybe just somebody's, like a headshot or something like that. So here with us today, we have the unbelievably beautiful Miss Kylie. We're gonna, get, we're gonna show you guys uh, these shots and go from there. Today I'm using the Sony a7R II with the Metabones Mark IV adapter and the Canon 85 1.2 lens. Let's do it. Gracias, mis prenda. You know what it is? This is a poor man's high-speed sync or poor man's HDR. Here, let's do this. I, I wanna show you guys one thing. Kylie, come right here, hon. This is an important teaching moment of the day. Now I want you two to walk closer and bring that light to her face. The closer the modifier gets to her face, the softer the light becomes. And look at that catch light. Isn't that gorgeous? I think it is. So I'm gonna get her close to the light source, just like this. Come on and take a shot. <laughs> That's just beautiful. Look down over your shoulder like that. Bring that shoulder up to you. Go like this. Just like that. One, two, three. I'm shooting these. Uh, five thousandths of a second f1.2 ISO 100. Now, let's, now we're going to bounce some light into her just with a small little reflector. Say just, yeah, just like that. Don't move. Yeah. Look at that catch light hitting from that reflector. One, two, three. Turn your body to me. Spread your feet out. There you go. Actually, pull the dress up. There you go. Show off them knees. <laughs> Fantastic. They're probably bruised. That's all right. Hips this way. Keep your, keep your body towards me. Come this way. Now just throw the hips that way. There we go. There we go. Now twist that that foot in the other way. Yeah, there you go. Just like that. Beautiful. One, two, three. Turn your head th that way towards the light. There we go. One, two, three. Eyes to me. Oh, she's shaking those shoulders. <laughs> One, two, three. What's up, girl? I'm making, I'm, am I making you uncomfortable? Nope. <laughs> Good to know. I'll try harder. I'm pretty hard to make uncomfortable. <laughs> One, two, three. Guys, now again, we're down at a, a beach type, well, we're down at the ocean. Heavy wind, this is where you want, you want a frame that's sturdy because the flimsy ones just will not work out here. They just will not. Wow, 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 great job, sister. Thanks. You're welcome. Guys, what, uh, something's wrong in my brain that I throw cameras. Yeah. When you use the diffusers out here, it also enables you to shoot at much wider apertures. So that's kind of why I made the joke about it being um, a poor man's, uh, I'm not saying it's super cheap, but you know, compared to buying a monolight and a flash and a modifier, you know, if you can get out here and, and put up a diffuser and cut down that light and then add a reflector, this is a much more natural way to do some high dynamic range type shots, uh, high dynamic range type work in your imagery. It really is. Um, and again, this is something that you would see done I've said it once, I'll say it again, I'm trying to bring some Hollywood type lighting to the world of photography uh, and, and show you guys what exists out there. Um, so again, this diffuser, a uh, couple hundred dollars, um, 
the reflector, just the entire set of the reflector, we're gonna do a separate video on that, is, is 80, 90 bucks. So it's not that much money, guys. And, and I do wanna say this, um, I understand everyone has their different budgets. And when I post these videos, you know, it's seemingly the first comments we get is, oh, I can build that out of a PVC, PVC pipe and a uh, sheet. Go ahead and do that, guys. See, uh, again, go ahead and do that. But what are you gonna cement that with sprinkler glue? And then you use it one time and then throw it, I just, guys, and even then, this is, this is nice fabric, it works, and it's something that you can take around, and if you take care of it, it'll last you for decades, it really will. So just food for thought, guys. I understand everybody has their different budgets, but if you're gonna get serious about getting great shots, then get some, get some good gear. It really makes a huge difference. And one of the reasons I'm doing these gear I use videos is we're trying to show you guys what gear is out there so you can choose what works best for you. So do you have any questions? No. Did you have a good time? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, you sure? Yeah. Yeah, okay, <laughs> good. You wanna introduce yourself to the world? Hi, I'm Kylie Millender. Do you wanna tell them where to find you? Uh, yeah, you can find me on social media. Um, let's see, Kylie Rochelle is what I go by on social media. So Awesome. So is that K-I-R-O-C-H-E-L-L-E? -L -L -E? Yeah, correct. Until next time, guys, keep shooting, never give up on your dreams. Find out gear that works for you. Be open-minded about the gear possibilities that exist out there. And remember, we only have one chance to get it right. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. You guys still here? Hello? Talking to you. Hey guys, if you want to learn online with me, go to patreon.com slash Photography, and you will be able to continue this craziness online from anywhere on planet Earth with me. If you want to join me live, go to jasonlinear.com slash workshops, and you'll get to see me in my full glory live and in person, guys. I think there's a smudge on there. Yeah, I got it. Talk to you later, guys.